Alright, so this is what we're going for. And we're going to start off with this eye that has completely nothing done to it. Um, the first thing I'm going to do is prime my eyelid. What I'm using is an eye primer by e.l.f. I'm just going to take this and apply it all over the entire lid area and then just blend it out. You could also take your finger and apply it underneath. Now I'm taking the new Urban Decay palette and we're going to be using Painkiller, which is the blue one. And we're also going to be using Flash which is a purple eyeshadow. So take Painkiller and I'm using a Sonia Kashuk brush and we're going to start by patting this in the center like this. So what you want to do is pack on the color first. These eyeshadows are so beautiful. This is one of my favorite ones. Alright, now you want to take another eyeshadow brush and I'm going to go in with Flash. Try to stop where your eyebrow ends. So right across from it, just extend it that far. And then just go in and gradually make it thinner as you get near the tear duct. So to deepen up the crease from the um, old Urban Decay palette, we're going to take um, Ransom with a crease brush and then we're just going to go into the crease and just make it a little bit darker. Go back with Painkiller if you feel like you lost some of the blue and just do patty motions to reapply the shade. Right here, and then just kind of bring it in right at the lash line. So make sure you apply that. And while I do this, I'm not putting a lot of pressure And then just do the same with the um, purple. The sponge tip applicator, I'm going to take the tip of it and just kind of blend this together where they meet. The only thing I have left to do is do the highlight and I'm using Sand Dollar from e.l.f. And I'm just going to take any eyeshadow brush. Um, I'm using an angled one. I'm just going to go in here and pick up some of this highlight. This is very, very loose, so you have to work with it like using patty motions like this. And I know it looks like I'm applying a lot, but actually it's very, very subtle, so it's not going to show. And I'm just going to take a blending brush and kind of blend this all together. The reason I like doing my highlight last is because if I have this purple or just any color that's on the brow bone, I can use this highlight to blend it in. Like that. Palette here by Sonia Kashuk and it's in Hidden Agenda. And I'm going to take the darkest shade on my finger and I'm just going to pat this underneath. I believe this palette is for fair skin. I obviously don't have fair skin but I like to use it just to bring light into my eye. What I'm going to do is comb my eyebrow and for that I'm using um, this Eyebrow Treat and Tame by Elle. I'm just going to take the brown side and this is going to um, 
lighten up my eyebrows since they're pretty dark. This is a brown tint, so as you can see, they already look brown. Eyeliner, and for eyeliner, I'm using a Clinique's True Black eyeliner. And I'm just going to line my waterline and my lid. So what I do is just take my finger and press it down like this. That way I don't have to pull on my skin. Just go like this. Just going to take a few coats. Alright, so here are the lashes that I'm using. They're pixie dust lashes and they look like this. Um, I got these about a year ago, like last Halloween. I just never used them, but I figure I'd do a um, Halloween tutorial for you guys. So it's top and bottom lashes and they have like a bunch of glitter on the tips, like pixie dust. So that's kind of like the whole inspiration was based around these lashes. So this is how they look on. Really dramatic. So it comes with glue and the glue that it comes with is actually very, very good. It's the lash grip. And I already have one, so I'm just going to try to use it up. Um, I'm just going to take some and put some on this. Mm, what should I put it on? Mm, yeah. Alright. I'm just going to put it in the back of this eyeshadow. And just take your glue, make sure you mix it up and everything. And just take some, kind of spread it around like that. And I'm going to use the tip of another brush to apply it to the lash line. We have the two eyes with the lashes on. I just love how they look. They're so long, right? Like, they're really super long and dramatic. And I'm just going to pat this on my lips first. So what I'm going to do is just take some of this lip gloss and I'm just going to apply some right here on the side, kind of making like a C. I'm just going to pat this down. I'm just going to go in with the same finger that I used to pat down the lip gloss. I'm just going to go in and as you can see, I already picked up a lot of the glitter and mine is pink. But like I said, they come in many different colors and this is just going to give you a really pretty glow like that and apply it like that and just kind of blend it and then go back in with the glitter I might do this for Halloween <laughs> so here it is again. Glitter, pretty pink lips. I hope you guys like it and thanks for watching. I hope you guys try it out and check out my blog for pictures because I will take pictures and then just post them on my blog. Bye!